Hi folks, welcome along to another video here for FC24. My name is Ash or Brom18 as always. And in this video today, we've got another kind of role recreation for you. Recently, I covered the John Stones role and the best way to kind of recreate it in game within the confines of this gameplay. And today I want to talk about the Trent Alexander-Arnold role, something that has come up here and there on the channel. And something that I think that can be recreated fairly accurately all things considered so with that being said roll the intro and let's get on with it so this is the end result that you can see here is what it will look like once you've made the changes but what we're going to want to do is we're actually going to go from the start so i can show you here and there how it's done so first things first what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to find the 433 holding formation or any formation really but this is the one we're going to go with in this case what we're then going to want to do is we're going to want to move alexander arnold up to right attacking midfield which i know can sound daunting but it is going to work i do promise you that now if you're going to want to do it in this system you're going to notice that's going to be a little bit of an issue so the way in order to make sure that he can fit in is just to move these guys out a little bit. So it's a Bosla in this case, we're going to move to RCM. We'll move McAllister down a little bit, but keep him at CDM. And then Jones can come along to left centre midfield. Now we've done that, you will notice that you can now move Alexander Arnold into this position right here, and you can set him as a Ram. Now it's important that he is a Ram and not a Cam. The reason being is that this is what's going to get him to track back and bed into the defensive line as a right back. Now, if he's a cam, you're going to notice there are going to be some issues and ultimately the right-sided winger is going to end up being the one who tracks back and forms in the back line, which obviously we're not looking for that with Salah in this case. The next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go over to the player instructions. We're on to Alexander-Arnold here. First things first, you want to get him come back on defence. That's what's going to get him tracking back. You'll notice now he's going to bed in with the back four and play as that right back, which again is ultra important while we have him a ram instead of cam. One thing I will say about the game is that it does do a really good job of recognising this and bringing him back into that position. So it replicates it fairly accurately the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want position freedom to be on free road because in this case with alexander arnold obviously he's coming deeper he's really closer to kind of the number six the number four of the kind of McAllister, the defensive midfielder than he is getting into those advanced areas with freer and what it's going to do it's going to make sure that he's dropping around into these pockets of space and into these areas when you have it on stick to position then they're pushed up more into those advanced areas in this case with him on free roam he's going to drop deeper and he's going to be able to pick up the ball from deeper so it replicates his role when the team's in possession far more accurately what's also important that with support and crosses you've got him on balanced we've noticed alexander arnold this season getting into the box but doing it in those kind of half channels and central areas more so as a result we want balanced crossing runs if you've got him always on getting to the box of the cross he's going to play more as like a boxer box midfielder which is not quite what we're looking for in this case we want to make sure it's only on balance so that he'll sometimes do it but in other moments he's going to kind of go a bit deeper be a bit more reserved in terms of his positioning uh, and less aggressive and as a result with all of those moves having been made you should get a role and an instruction and a player that's going to replicate alexander arnold's role fairly accurately at least probably 90 to 95 percent as what it would be in real life which is really really good and the game does a fairly decent job of replicating this and with that being said i think we're just about ready to finish it off there if you found this video helpful you want to see more make sure to hit the subscribe button but most importantly check out my patreon lots of fantastic perks and rewards on there exclusive tactics videos this fifa 24 tactics package behind the scenes videos discord server access scouts and reports on real players and a whole lot more do go and check that out and a massive thank you to my patrons for continuing to support the channel with that being said we're going to finish it off there thank you very much for watching everyone and until the next one I'll see you soon.